this. When you go to this site, if you do begin activity and you keep it this small, it's very hard to, to look at. So keep in mind that you can enlarge it by going to the top uh, left-hand corner. It makes it very large. What this basically is, is it's 11 different animations. You're going to try to choose the correct matching graph. So we'll start with this one. You don't have to go in order. It's going to show you a car moving in a direction and it's going at what looks to be a very constant rate of speed. And there's a very clear indication of that by the dots that it's leaving behind, presumably the exhaust from the car. Um, it's important to note that this is a positive direction. And the reason why that is, is consider this point zero or, or starting point zero, and it's moving in this direction. So when we're looking for a graph, uh, we're looking for a graph that is moving uh, in a positive direction, meaning it's in its position, it's moving um, this way, because this is zero in position. This is increasing, increasingly moving away from a starting point. Okay. And what this would indicate here is that this is time passing. So here, this car is, is increasing its, its speed at which it's moving away from its starting point of zero. So I'm not going to think this graph matches that. Although the, the thing is, if you want to guess and check, you could, it's going to tell you that's wrong, so you can try again. So that's the nice thing about this. It's going to show you the animation again. And so you'll be looking at this. Now, this deals with velocity and time. So don't get too confused about this, but this is the change in direction uh, that the car is taking. And again, if we consider this um, starting point, you know, um, I don't know, whatever you want to give it, a negative 5, and this is zero. This would be the car moving in this direction if it went that way. So this velocity would be moving from a negative point to a positive point. Let's, let's not get caught up in that. But So what I'm looking for is a graph that is going to show me, I'll watch the animation again, it's moving from a zero point of origin to moving further away from me, and it's going at a constant rate of speed. So again, I'm flipping through these, and I'm looking, and you could guess and check on any of these. Um, but what it's doing is it's a constant rate of speed. So there is no increase in speed, no, no speeding up, no slowing down. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to think this one is a good example of that because I'm looking at my position changing, getting further and further away, and the time that's passing is very constant. So it's going to give me this nice straight line. And if I check that, it's going to say congratulations. Now, as I said, some of these are more difficult than others. Um, but so just, just kind of play around with it. But when you get it wrong, take a look at what you got wrong and consider it. Some are going to make more sense than others. Uh, you might get them right, um, right off the bat and that's great, but it's going to give you this gold star. So 